After making it, I wanted to go on a gigantic holiday. It was quite intense. The Theory of Everything is a remarkable tale of Stephen Hawking. Eddie Redmayne plays the main man himself, and yet the word Oscar has already been mentioned. Now, tell me, mister, I came out of this film wanting to change the world. Did you? Did you feel that it like that That is the best news afterwards? I've ever heard. Um, did I feel like that after what, making it? After making it? No, after making it, I wanted to go on a gigantic holiday. It was quite intense. Um, no, it was the most amazing mixture of formidable privilege and great fear making this film. And um, um, did you become a little bit of a geek afterwards? I mean, I gave up science when I was like 14. So the greatest feat for me was trying to educate myself enough to be able to persuade people that I knew what I was talking about. Um, but no, I, I worked with some of like Stephen's old students, and they would be teaching me the intricacy of string theory. I'd be going home and going to like astronomyforkids.org and trying to trying to. But do you understand it now? I do. I mean, I understood enough to be able to, to, to play him convincingly in, in, in the parts of the film that I had to. Now tell me, if the word Oscar is mentioned, and I know it's boring to hear, but if it is mentioned, how are you going to feel? Three words that you're going to feel when you find out that news. Oh, God. No, I can't. I can't possibly. I, was, I genuinely, um, genuinely, when we got cast, Felicity and I, in this, the, the stakes felt so high. We were like, there was... It was a bit of a knife edge of, of, of a, a, a great sense of expectation. So, frankly, the fact that Stephen and Jane enjoyed it and Jonathan and the children, that was the greatest reward for us. So. And I hear that you trained, like, did lots of kind of dance research to get into this character. Now, has this helped you for your first dance at your wedding? <laughs> Not so much dance research, but I did work with a, a dancer who helped me sort of understand Stephen's physicality. I'm the worst dancer in the world. Oh, no, so. I want to see you on Strictly. Oh. <laughs> Do you know what, it was funny actually, I was, was working with a dancer to help me on this and I told her I couldn't dance and one day she tried and she was like, yeah right, by the way, if they ever ask you to be on Strictly, say no. So that's not happening.